Hello and welcome to this series of videos on the ZNL Network Analyzer. The ZNL Network Analyzer is a three-in-one all-rounder that contains a network analyzer, spectrum analyzer, and the ability to make power measurements. In this video, I'm going to show you how to set it up to do a spectrum analyzer measurement. In the last video, we performed the network analyzer measurements, and this is where we left off performing the S22 measurement on an antenna. If we start with the preset function here, then I can recall the save setup that we previously saved here in the quick start menu. And now in the mode menu, I'm going to add a spectrum analyzer measurement. So here we can see we're sweeping all the way up to three gigahertz. In this setup, I also have a transmitting antenna, which is delivering the Wi-Fi signal at 2.4 gigahertz that we're receiving here on port two, the RF input of the network analyzer stroke spectrum analyzer in this case. And we can see over here, this is the frequency of interest where if I put a marker here, it automatically goes to the maximum point. We can see 2.39 gigahertz. So let's zoom in in the same way that we did with the network analyzer. We can use the pinch zoom capability. And in the measurement menu, you have the ability to have predefined measurements here. So things like uh, adjacent channel leakage ratio, carrier to noise ratio, spectrum emission masks, uh, and also the ability to do time domain uh, and harmonic distortion measurements. Over at the bottom here, where we have the overview menu, then this gives us a nice one page overview of all of the settings that we currently have configured on the spectrum analyzer measurement. So here, then we can see that we have the amplitude settings, frequency settings, and so on. So in this case, I want to go to the display config. And in here, you can see that I have the ability to add some additional measurements onto the current trace. So I'm going to select the spectrogram, and this will allow me to see the waterfall performance of the modulated signal. And if I just hold the antenna here that's transmitting, you can see how the colors change, red being the stronger signal going through to the receiving antenna. Once I have everything set up here, then again, like in the first video, I want to save this setup. So in the Save menu, I can use one of the 10 quick save settings or just overwrite the first one here. So thank you for watching the second video on the ZNL Network Analyzer. For more information, please visit our website where you'll find plenty of other videos and further information. Thank you.